It's now 644 here on your Tuesday morning. Even at a young age, kids may have a dream career, but it's not too often they get to work on those skills to go ahead and achieve that dream. That's right, but a program part of making big parks and rec is helping kids who've been bitten by the communications bug and are already dreaming big. Our morning reporter TJ Anthony is live in the studio with more details on this program. Good morning, TJ. Good morning, that's right. And with the heightened use of digital media, kids and teens are finding more and more interest in things like YouTube, photography, computers, and a lot of other communications activities. The Macon Bibb Teen County Communications Program is working to prepare the upcoming generation to achieve their dreams in communication. Kids are getting the opportunity to get ahead of their dreams through the Macon Bibb County Teen Communications Program. Whether it's acting or sports broadcasting, the program is helping kids work on their skills for their future. What made me want to join the program was acting. I want to be an actress. Ninth grader Jakaya Reed says she's learned a lot from the program. And so far, her grandma, Sheila Ashley, appreciates her granddaughter's growth. Before she came into the program, she dealt with social anxiety and issues with public speaking. And when, before she came in, she would break out in sweats just trying to have a, a conversation with people. From interviewing skills to behind the camera work, she says the program has helped her granddaughter a lot. We've seen her blossom tremendously in those areas, so that, that has been an amazing bonus for us. Sports broadcasting, camera work, video editing, and teamwork are just some of the skills kids are learning and program manager Ja'Cory Bazell is teaching to achieve his goal for his students. A professional experience, you know, real life experience, and also to be able to uh, take, you know, what they learned here and uh, take it to a next level. The program started last year and they have seen the number of teens interested growing. I mean, it originally started October the 9th. Uh, we only had two students to uh, register and then over, um, you know, the course of less than a year, um, we've had, we've jumped up to uh, where we have 35 active. An opportunity students can use to get ahead of their dreams or to dream bigger. It's given them the ability to dream outside of their home. Now, if you're looking to check out the skills of the teens in the program, students are gearing up to, read, to live stream a boxing event that will be live on their Facebook page this Saturday. So, Caitlin and Wani, look, they really will be taking our job soon, but we have to give it up to them. They're doing amazing. Definitely a yes. huge shout out to them doing big things out there off of Mercer University Drive. And it's great that they're learning um, all those resources mm -hmm. and tools at just such a young age, Caitlin. Absolutely, just to help them see what their dream could be, even if they don't end up in communications, those skills, interviewing, that, those are things that will last a lifetime. Exactly, lifelong skills. Now, they will also be celebrating their anniversary of the program. I'll have some festivities happening on Saturday, October the 8th.